Hi, I'm Rhythma Brar of Arterior Studio, and you're here at the Pasadena Showcase House, and we're here to talk a little bit about my collaboration with the Art Wolf and the art pieces that uh, were incorporated in the sunroom and the outdoor terrace for the Pasadena Showcase House. Hi, I'm Yael. I'm the Art Wolf. Oh, woo! Oh, woo! <laughs> <laughs> I had so much fun working with Rhythma on this project. We got to come to the house when it was completely empty mm -hmm. and talk about her vision for the space and we got to do some measurements and she decided she wanted a large piece right here. Um, nature, landscape, I should let you talk about this part. <laughs> yeah, exactly. With, with this being the sunroom um, and very limited wall space that I had, I didn't want to force the art in this space. So with the three panel walls that I had, this was definitely the more center statement making wall. And um, I just wanted one piece that could really make a statement here. I have, the space in general has a lot of color. And I felt like this piece, whatever this piece would be over here, I wanted to have, wanted to be black and white or something that's a bit muted, but that really blended well with the space and brought it, brought it to life in a way where it looks like you're mirroring the outdoor landscape but on the inside. So for Rhythma, I curated a selection of images from my photographer, Diana Lopez. She's known as Dopez, <laughs> um, including this large piece, which is TSR Outlook, as Rhythma just beautifully um, told. And she also said she wanted this brass frame. So the beauty of working with a designer from the beginning is that we can produce a piece to your size specification, frame to your specification, everything that you design in your room. And if you want to get a little bit closer, this is another work by Dopez, Baby Got Back. <laughs> this One is... My favorite pieces. <laughs> and again, I presented a selection of images to Rhythma, um, letting her know that we had this new style of printing on this very thick acrylic. So this, um, this picture spoke to her. I love it as well. And I think it just came out so beautifully. You know, the history of the house, that it comes from the 1930s. There is a lot of uh, Parisian inspiration in this house and the architecture. So this piece had some sort of remnants to that, where I felt like it would be fun to have a beautiful sculptural element through photography, um, you know, paying homage to that era of when the house was built. So as I was designing the outdoor terrace, uh, which is also one of my spaces at the Showcase House, um, I was looking for some very unique sculptural elements that I could put in my outdoor, outdoor area. And we talked about different shapes and sizes and types of sculpture or imagery that we could use. And this was one of the pieces that spoke to me the most. For me, she showed me the image I saw and I, I fell in love with it. But when she gave me the detailed explanation of what it is, um, it just became a no brainer. And I'll have you, I'll take over to explain what this piece actually is. So I love getting people's reaction to the sculpture when they come through the showcase, but most of them can tell that it is a female form. Um, this piece is by my artist Osiris Zuniga. She is an amazing sculptress, born in Colombia and raised in Brooklyn. She is a total badass woman welder. This is inflated steel and the name of this piece is Swollen. So for my outdoor space, my bar over here is actually one of the statement pieces and one of the highlights of this entire space. And as you can see, the bar itself is a pretty, it's got a very masculine feel to it. And so I needed to find, think of ways to sort of soften the look and just give it a little, it has a lot of personality, but tame the personality, so to speak. And so in addition to the florals and some of the other accessories that I added to it, it needed art. It felt like it was craving some sort of an art piece. And so I have seen this piece curated um, elsewhere and it is one of my favorite pieces from the moment I saw it. It's called Seeing Sound. And with the whole lounge, Moroccan lounge vibe and this bar that I have here, I just felt it was the right piece to sort of add to this, the beauty of this bar. And I will let again, yeah, I'll take over to give a little more details about what this piece actually means. So this is also by my photographer, Dopez. And as Rhythma said, the piece is called Seeing Sound. Um, Dopez is a New York City street photographer and poetess, and she snapped this photo in the New York City subway. And people's reaction to this piece has been just beautiful. You're in a couple of different uh, designs that we've displayed it. Um, also, the very special thing about this is that it's printed on metal for outdoor display. So it won't fade and the rain is fine. And it just opens up a whole new world of art in the garden, art outdoors. So we love working with designers like Rhythm, especially in Southern California, to bring art to the outdoors. 